Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. So we have another haul slash pack with me. I know it's been heavy with the pack with me's kind of video, <laughs> but I feel like it's the best way to show you the stuff that's like new in. And also I feel like a lot of people actually do like the pack with me. So I just kind of combine them. And I feel like the start of this year has been pretty hectic. So this is just like the best way for me to film them. So hopefully that's fine. Also, it means I don't have to look cute and get ready. But as you can probably tell from the chaos around me, I am packing for another trip. This is actually a work one and it's literally for 48 hours. I'm going to Morocco for 48 hours with Audi, which I'm so excited about. So it's gonna be a little different to obviously like my usual trips. And I have actually been to Morocco before but that was maybe like three, four years ago with an ex-boyfriend. <laughs> so hopefully this one will be a little less dramatic than the last. So I've ordered some new bits in because I kind of just panicked. I don't really know what to order or where because we're going to drive some cars. And then also I want to obviously be respectful mm. while I'm there. So... I'll show you some new in bits that I that I have got. So I literally just had a knock on the door, which was from ASOS. So I've just ordered some bits here. I actually did order some new in trainers because my like everyday gym slash Pilates trainers are gross. <laughs> They're just super old New Balances. I wear them so much to the point that they've got a hole in the front. So I was like, Joe, you know what? It's time you get some new pair of trainers. So I picked up these. There were so many different colors. I didn't really know which color to go for, but I felt like this color was more likely to go with most of my wardrobe. So they are just these gold and silver and black <laughs> new balances. And I thought they would just be handy. One Pilates in the morning just to chuck them on. And then also I've been doing like some hikes and activities on my trips and I feel like I needed a new pair of trainers. So this is them and I love them. So I will link those down below. I mean, some of this isn't gonna be for this trip. I either just bought it in general or I've bought it for my next Ibiza trip. So I saw these shorts and I thought they were so freaking cute. I just had to order them. They are Daisy Street via ASOS, but they're just these cream little shorts. And then I've got lace at the bottom. They kind of remind me of, are they called bloomers? Like little bloomers. I think I sized up. So I got a size eight. Let me just quickly try them on. Okay, no, I do not like those. I feel like one, they either need to be shorter and tight or they need to be baggier. I mean, I like the idea of them, but no, do not like these. It'd be cute if they were like that. Well, that's not a good start, <laughs> but I will return them. Then I also have these trousers. Again, I just thought they were like good, like lounge chill trousers. I feel like they're cute and they're also great to like travel in. Be great for like the airport or like around the pool. So these probably aren't going to come to Marrakesh with me, but I think I am going to keep these. Okay, I'm on the hunt for a good pair of denim shorts. I already feel like these are going to be a no. Um, I thought they were going to be longer. Oh, I don't know. So I just picked up these Topshop denim shorts. I don't want hot pants and I also don't want like Bermuda short kind of ones, but let's just try these on. Okay, take it back. I quite like these. I like these. I feel like they're a good length and they're not too tight. They're a bit baggy. Also, I walked into a lamppost. I mean, it's slowly going, but that's not ideal. I feel like these are a good wardrobe staple for summer. So I'm gonna keep these. 
I just hate shorts, especially denim shorts that are like tight to the thigh. Just not really my vibe. Okay, I didn't actually quite realize everything is shorts or trousers. Um, but then I also got these boxer style shorts. I just love the boxer short trend at the moment and I love these colors. They're sweet, I like those. I mean, I feel like they could be like a tiny bit shorter, but I really like the colors and I like the little button detailing and they're actually so soft. So I'm gonna keep these. Okay, and then the next item is a little bit different for me. <laughs> But there's something I just loved about it. I mean, I don't know if I'm going to be able to pull it off, but it is this colourful skirt. And for Morocco, I didn't want to be wearing like short shorts or short skirts because obviously you do have to be very respectful there. So I thought maybe this could be a fun little item to take. I mean, it's very colourful. I don't really like the look of the shape but let's just see but I thought this could look cute with just like a little baby yellow vest top ow sipped up my skin okay do you know what I don't actually hate it but I don't know if I love it I'm so sorry this little try on is so hectic and messy but this is just the reality of my packing <laughs> um Do you know what? It's actually very cute. I just don't think it's Morocco. Like, I might actually take this to Ibiza with me. I feel like this would look cute with like a little yellow bikini. Okay, so I might actually save that skirt for Ibiza. I'm just gonna put my pants back on. And then, last but not least, I just picked up this vest top. I thought it was a great alternative on your like usual tank tops. Just like double lined, it's got a black one and then, oh, they are actually separates as well. Is it? That's handy, so you can wear them as separates. But it's just this black and white tee. So basically you get two t-shirts for the price of one. But I thought that would be great with like black linen trousers or even jeans, so I'll keep that. So it was like semi-successful. I do actually have so many new bits in for Ibiza. Obviously with Ibiza you can be, you can be a bit more fun. And a bit more like out there. With, whereas with Morocco, you have to be a bit more reserved and respectful. So they're two completely different vibes, but, got my packing cubes also have i mentioned i'm literally going for two days <laughs> but i think this pile of stuff here is the stuff i'm going to take with me also those are my clean bed sheets i want to make my bed before i go so that when i come back i can get into clean bed sheets because i arrive back like late friday night um but I kind of planned my outfits. I just sent them all to Emily Maloney as she is also coming. So, potential dinner outfit. I've just got a white linen skirt and then a matching halter neck waistcoat. So I thought that could be one option. And like, that's smart. I'm basically just going to fold everything up into piles so then I can see what I've got and then I can sort my accessories out. So that's one potential dinner outfit. And then my other potential dinner outfit, also we have one dinner. <laughs> um, but I don't really know. God, I'm in a pickle. I don't really know what the vibe is going to be but then I also have this Zara Maxi dress. 
I mean, I should have sized up. I think I got an extra small. So it's a bit snug, but now it's sold out. Um, and I feel like this dress is obviously a bit more special. Where else am I gonna wear this to? I don't really know. I mean, you're on your holly bobs. I feel like you can go a bit more extra. So those are my two options for dinner. So I'll just leave that there. Why am I out of breath? <laughs> also, I picked these cute little pyjamas up from Primark today. So these are going to be my pyjamas for the trip. They are just these little fruity PJs. So you've got the shorts. And then the shirt. That's so cute. So those are going to be PJs. And then I have this gorgeous skirt, which if you watched my last pack with me, I tried on, but I didn't end up taking it away with me. So I was thinking this knitted four from Rapless skirt with just a simple black tank top. And then I did actually pick this up morning from um primark i mean i don't know if it's going to be too extra <laughs> i don't actually know how you wear it that's a day option um i've made a list so i need a travel outfit let me actually do this in order so i actually know what my travel outfit is i've got these new in trousers which i'm obsessed with they are from i mean i don't know how you pronounce that <laughs> And I hate butchering brand names. So it's from that brand, but they're just like the perfect lounge pant. So they're great to travel in, but then also I could, if I wanted to, wear them during the day and they're super soft. So I'm gonna travel in them with this vest top which is also from the same brand, but it's just so flattering. It's a simple white tank top, but the fit of it is literally unreal. And then at the back, it goes down a little. So that is my travel outfit. And then I'll just wear a blazer or a jumper or something like that. And then my new Gucci mules. So that is that. And then we don't really know if we're going to have time to change for the drive, but I'm going to pack an outfit just in case we do, because I would ideally love to get changed for the drive. So I think for that, I'm going to wear this gorgeous Topshop dress. Again, I showed it in my last pack with me video, but I didn't pack it. <laughs> so I feel like that could be gorgeous and then accessories I'll kind I'll probably do like a silk little necktie maybe or I also have this gorgeous bandana which I picked both I picked both of these up in Primark today it's like one day look I just need to figure out shoes might even do my black netted H&M shoes that you've seen a thousand times so that is one day outfit. And then Friday morning we have like a 6 a.m. drive. So for that, I think I'm just gonna wear this like linen suit. This is from h and I actually picked this up yesterday. I don't actually like, they don't actually match, which is very annoying, but I feel like it's fine. I feel like you can actually get away with that. So I feel like this, with a plain tank top, which I need to get. And then again, could even do a necktie. I have actually got a little red one with like a white t-shirt, that could be cute. And I feel like this is a great, like early morning casual look. And I could also wear this home to travel in. So that is another day look.
So that's that one. And then after we have that drive, we have the opportunity to explore. So for that, I think I'm going to wear, I mean, everything's long, but it's fine. I'm either gonna wear this skirt with the black t-shirt that I mentioned, or I'm gonna wear this white maxi skirt, which needs an iron, but we'll figure that out, with just a plain vest top. This is from Next. They do the best basics, and it came in a pack of three, and it's just so nice. And then, could I either leave it simple, or I could wear this, which I love. It's new in from Zara. On the website, it showed it with a pair of shorts, but I couldn't find the shorts on the website, which I'm gutted about because I loved it as a set. But I thought I'd buy this anyway, because I could wear it alone. Um, but I just love this for like spring, summer. How gorgeous is that? I could even wear the red necktie with that, or I could wear it as a little bandana. Um, but yeah, I just think that is so nice. Again, I don't know what shoes. Do you know what I need? I need like a simple black khaki pair of sandals. It'd be like my exploring outfit with my by far bag. I feel like that is a vibe. I like that a lot. So I'll probably end up wearing that over this but i'm gonna pack this just in case it's good to have options you know also i don't actually know if i'm gonna have time in between all these activities <laughs> to get changed but it's better to be over prepared than under under prepared and also we have a check-in bag so you might as well pack it if you've got the allowance you know so that's that oh that was easy I also have this gorgeous dress. I might just take this anyway, but this is from Verge. It is so beautiful. I don't know what, I could even maybe wear this for dinner. Again, I don't know if it's like, I don't know if that's allowed. Like it's not see-through, but it's not not. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> um. And then that could also look great with that. Maybe I'll just pack that just in case. And then I'm gonna pack the denim shorts, maybe just with this oversized shirt. Because I could even wear this shirt with these. I picked this up from Primark just because I needed some like lounge baggy shirts and I just love the colors. So, I'll also pack that and then I'll just grab some like basic vest tops and then I need to do jewellery, shoes and any other little random accessories and then obviously I need to do beauty bits. But outfit planning, I mean granted it's for two days, but that is possibly the quickest I've done it. <laughs> This brings me so much joy. I love a freaking packing cube. Um, so I've put each outfit for each different thing into its own packing cube. Then I'm also going to put my underwear into the cube. So I can literally just get the cube. Everything's there, including my underwear, my sunglasses, and then... I've got all my jewellery in this little pouch here. I love that for me. Really freaking love that. Then I do also over there have some extras and like miscellaneous kind of vibe. But then these are all my outfits and then my shoes are in there. She is an organised girl. Okay, as you can tell, I've just got out of the shower. Currently catching up on Vanderpump Pump Rules. But I'm going to close out this video here because I need to get ready to leave for 
the airport as i mentioned i'm staying there tonight but i want to edit and upload this vlog before i go so it's uploaded for tomorrow and i'm not going to take my laptop with me so i need to end it now so i can edit and get that done but the packing is basic healing what is that I'm peeling. <laughs> that is from the hike where I forgot to sun cream my back. Anyway, um, I'm all packed. I've just got to put my air wrap in and then my toiletries and stuff, but obviously I need to get ready. So that will all be put in last minute. But the satisfaction I got of packing my cubes into my suitcase probably isn't normal, but just let me show you. Look how neat. And tidy that is the joy it brings me probably shows that i need to get a life but that is all done also these are my new suitcases i did show you in a vlog but just in case you don't watch that they are from a brand called july they are so gorgeous so this is like the big one and then this is the small one i'm not actually taking this one tomorrow because it's not necessary for two days but i'm obsessed with the color i also got it personalized a bit extra <laughs> but i freaking love it and then there was a few colors to pick from but i went for this green and i also chose the trunk style the only thing i'm worried about is like if it's going to be heavy like the actual suitcase but i will report back and let you know in a different vlog but I'm sorry they are bougie and they're very cute but now i need to go so <laughs> thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this vlog and i will see you in my next video